We're here with offensive line coach Ben McKig. Uh, coach, what have been some of the posit positives you've seen this week? I think, I mean, the number one positive out of our group is going to be the leadership. Um, we have a good group of seniors, and they've definitely stepped up and, you know, led practice in a way that we can have a good tempo and, you know, we can get the skill work that we need. Um, also seeing a lot of guys really improving their technique, um, you know, just hands, footwork, things like that. Um, little things that are going to make a big difference if they continue to improve. So. And just coming on staff two months or so ago, uh, how has it been implementing your system? Um, I mean, they kind of got to start in the spring without me. So these guys have a good base knowledge. Um, like I said, a lot of the things that we're working on are going to be the little techniques. I played in the system for Coach Walter, so I'm familiar with a lot of the, the uh, kind of nuances of the offense. And so teaching those guys those little things, you know, they have the broad knowledge, but now the finer techniques and the uh, abilities to make calls and things like that really are going to help them out. So, And you talked about a little bit about your uh, veterans on the team. How have they been in helping the young guys get acclimated? Well, we actually had to talk about that after practice today. Um, you know, our young guys got to get used to the way that we do things. Um, I call it closing the yearbook. You know, they got to put high school away. A lot of them want to talk about that's just like this block in high school. You know, and sometimes it is, but sometimes we do things a little bit different. Mm -hmm. And they got to start picking up on those things. And then uh, the tempo of the practice. And our guys do a nice job, our older guys especially, um, running to drills, getting on and off the field, playing hard all the way to the whistle. And that's something those young guys are going to see those guys doing, and they're going to start to learn that, um, especially with the positive leadership that we've been getting. So um, they just got to come along. You know, it's a development process. Sure. And luckily, we have enough older guys and, and some veteran leadership that we won't be fully relying on a lot of those freshmen. So. And last question for you, Coach. What are your overall expectations for your players this season? Um, you know, they set expectations for themselves, and I expect them just to go out there and work hard and get better every day. Um, I truly believe in, in the process of getting better, you know, as, and especially on the offensive line. Every day you just you work on your technique and you improve a little bit, and you get to see the end result at the end of the day. So, you know, if they bring that positive attitude, that's kind of my expectation of them and, and uh, that focus that we need to practice. And I know we're going to get great results out of, out of that group and then out of the team as well. So um, that's really my biggest expectation. And, I think the results will take care of themselves. We definitely have some talent and we have ability. And uh, if they continue to work on those, those fine things and, and improve, good things are going to happen. So, Thanks, Coach. All right. Appreciate, Appreciate it, man. You. Yeah.